Greetings, good people. It's your boy H. Cortez, one and only financial health mentor to the working class, and you're checking out Capitalism in America, How the Money Game is Played. Okay guys, welcome back. If you and I sit down and play the game of Monopoly, I'm very, very familiar with the rules. You don't know any of the rules. Do you think you'd ever be able to beat me in that game of Monopoly? Well, the same is true when it comes to capitalism in America and how the money game is played. If you don't know the rules of the game, there's no way that you ever be able to play that game to win. So let's talk about how the money game is played and more importantly, how you, my friend, can play to win. There's three ways that you earn income in America. You earn through a W-2 or a job, through a 1099 or a business, or through some sort of investments. The reason it's important to know that is because the way you earn income in America determines how you're taxed in America. W-2 or laborers are taxed the most, 28 to 33%. Uh, business owners, uh, the net result of uh, owning a business, the taxes equate to 18 to 23%. And then when you're making money with money, you're taxed at less than 15%. And that's important because taxes is, uh, what most people don't realize is your taxes is your biggest expense especially when you're in the W-2 category to upwards of 33%. That's just income tax. Then you add in sales tax, you add in your local taxes, you add in your personal property taxes, and your tax liability can be upwards of 50, 60% sometimes when you're working a job. Why is it set up this way? Because the system made a self-perpetuating organism that will continue to feed itself over time. If the W-2s are taxed the most, then the system benefits, gives benefits to an employer or a business so that they can create more W-2s, right? Then you have to look at, well, what about the investments? Well, guess what? When the business needs to grow, increase their inventory, increase their uh, infrastructure, the business owner goes to investors to get the capital to expand so when they expand they can hire more of these and the more of these the system that are in the system the more money the system makes so when you understand that then you can plan accordingly because what we teach people is that the best way to win at this game of capitalism is when you add a w-2 with a 1099 the reason that's important is because when you add the 1099 to the W-2, now you have an income that will take care of you for today, but then you have the tax advantages of a business owner that can create write-offs for your lifestyle and for things that you're paying for all day, every day, month in, month out, now become legal, ethical, legitimate tax deductions. And when you save that tax money, you can then free up the cash that you need to start investing. We have a system called income shifting that will walk you from a W-2 through a 1099 and ultimately put you in a position to start investing if you so choose. So to learn more about our income shifting program, I want you to click on the link below or get back with the person that shared this information with you and they will teach you how we're playing the money game and playing to win. So until I talk to you next time, I'm your boy H. Cortez, financial health mentor to the working class. Get your money up because you can do it. Peace.